a joke. Yeah. I got how to really video. I made a tutorial on like loosening the tension straps and tightening the front suspension on the XCF. Bro, this is a dirty girl. Jesus. Anyways, so now that you've, you've rebuilt this thing, put your new clutch spring in there and greased her up, got her all nice and clean, except on the back side where there's absolute filth. Jesus. You're going to slap that sucker back in there. Here you go. That's the first time. You're going to want to use high temp um, wheel bearing grease because it's actually the same thing, spinning real fastly. Oh, shoot. And it's going to be high temp. Hey, you want to grab that grease gun for me, please? Yeah. And there's a ball, or there's a uh, bearing for your speedometer and your drive shaft. You're going to want to grease that while you're down there, too. So we're going to be doing that right now. He's fat and eating all the good and funnies. I'm fat, eating all the good and funnies. I'm fat, not eating any funnies. He ate half the box. I'm gonna make sure it's coming out at least, I guess. Throw the right on the ground. Get her on the nipple. Go away until you see your grease coming out. I see that. Should be good. That was one drive bearing. He's lucky his drive shaft and track didn't blow in half. Yep. Now you're gonna throw that puppy back in there. You're gonna pour a one for the spare part to Oh, here it is. Here's our. Oh, it's probably greased that. Oh, no. Yeah, I guess. Do a little penetrating wall. Alright. Do not get any of that spray inside of these clutches. You're not going anywhere and you're going to burn your belt right off. It's also important to remember how many washers you had on here. I had two smaller washers. And what spacers. Order? Yeah. It's important to know that. So, let's throw this bad boy back in there. Starting to go. That's that's a plus. You're gonna want to look up your factory torque specs for this, or else it'll fly right off. Also, uh, this is the highest setting on a purple uh, purple Plus spring. Spring. Yeah, there you go. Purple. Uh, got got a, purple a nice bed. nice helix right there. Pretty. Pretty expensive one as well. I don't remember how much I paid for this, but it was expensive. Got it down in heydays. Um, now you look for your ratchet. Then your dad is where you go. Come here. Was. I'll show you a trick. Oh, Come thanks. here. I'll show you a trick. See these these purple power bands? That's the best power band that you can get. Everybody's always talking about the the blue power bands. The purple's where it's at. Get a nice launch and she's smooth all the way through. Yep. And also, when you're doing wheelies, you'll do wheelies for about 20 feet and then it absolutely falls on its face. That's the best part. Just kidding. Sure, hold on. Lock the brake, lock the brake. When you're tightening these down to your factory torque specs, do not show them. Uh, you're gonna wanna hold the brake. She's torqued. That was a torque wrench, by the way, folks. That, that, was, that, was, a, that was a spend. So, you're gonna wanna hold the brake. So your secondary clutch doesn't spin. That's a little trick for you. I learned when I was just a little squirt. Also, another trick. Do not put the tools back where they went. Well, you do it do it if they're your tools, but if they're like your dad's tools or whatever, I usually uh That's not a mechanic, no. I usually mechanic. just give her a good toss across the across the garage. I can't do that no more because you got concrete flooring. Hey Dude. daddy got mad the last time. I don't know why Daddy got so mad. Straight through. 
the car window. Right after that, he bought me this brand new 2021 Articat. He got mad at me. Max Lollum in the chat. Alright, now we got our... On my Ultra, my Polaris, this clutch, the, the secondary clutch, flies so far out of the sled and the bolt just disappears right in the thin air. And then you gotta get towed in mud all the way back home with this thing, with this beauty. Yep, she tucked her on, right? That's how it works. Was that 10 mil? Get the camera out of my face, boy! Also, uh, always steal your buddy's 10 mils. No, it's pretty funny. Uh, but not to me. Never to me. I just get right here. I can't see right now on this one. But on this, the inside part of the secondary clutch, it had some pretty bad uh, chips in it. That's not always the best, but when it's an Arctic hat, it's just the best there is. Plain and simple. It wakes up in the morning and it pisses oil. Okay, so you know it doesn't. I thought the same was supposed to piss excellence. It is. And it Shut does. up! Did you? What do you know what you're talking about? You're, you're supposed to hold the camera and not talk. Shut up, cameraman. Shut up, camera. Well, there it is, right here. There we are. Oh. oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, just a second. Take are you gonna put the belt on? No. Hey, okay. get, get up close to this. This is what I was talking about. The little, little, little bits right there. The little, the little tit bits on the secondary. It's probably fine. Uh, That's actually, if that wasn't there because your dad did it. See how there's sparks, several. That prob, he probably did that if he did not. But that will give you extra grab on your belt. That's that's actually not messing around. Like some people actually recommend if you're gonna race, they sand the inside of the Or clutches. or they tape one of these hammers and then they just Alright. Alright, hello everybody. We're going to do how to put on a belt tutorial on this Articat five hundred. Um, we're just gonna show you how to put on a belt, I guess. I, I don't know. We're running out of ideas for content because this thing's a piece and doesn't want to run. So first off, you're gonna need a decent belt. Like this one right here, it's okay I guess, but it's not decent, so we're not using it. It's not brand new, So factory spec. We were having troubles having this thing move because as you can see here, the belt is worn. Clearly, the, put it, put the, it like this, just, that, there you go. see how much thicker? The top belt. I wasn't grabbing. Well, that, that's not a good comparison. Right here. You go. See the the belt on your left is thicker than the belt on your right. Now, so this is a piece. Piece of junk. Burning cares. So you're gonna open this. Okay. You're gonna cut your fuel lines, and then you're gonna. Usually, what I do is I put it over the primary first. Whittle it in there, piece of cake. It's gonna be a, a lot harder if you have snow in the engine bay. A lot harder. Okay, anyways, then you bring it over to the secondary. Get under that. Uh, I'll let you bring it over. Shut up! Bring it over to the top, kind of roll it. For 
first time this kid ever put a belt on, or what? Yes, it is actually. That's what I thought. Okay, maybe we should put it over the secondary first. No, no, oh, that's, no, 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 you cannot do that. Like, Shut up! said I could do it myself. Do one of these? You're going to want to get an assistant named Zach back there. But, for this application, you look just fine. So get your butt up here. Right now. Show them. Show them. Oh. Oh, just like that. You're not going to want to want to play in there. Or else you're going to mess stuff up. See that? That's how you slap a belt on there. So, that's the end of the video. Zach, cut the cams. Yeah, it's still bad.